So, here's a quick repair on a giant speaker for someone at work, and they wanted me to see what was wrong. This joint right here is one of our power, well, joints, or basically one of the tabs that gets started to the board, and it's been broken loose. It was why I was able to, to identify at work. So, we're just going to quickly just resolder that and see if this actually charges and works. Looking at it closer, after I resoldered that one joint, I shouldn't have been able to move the actual port as much as I did. So it made me wonder if the back port was actually cracked and broken off, which it was. So I hate being right. So now we're going to actually find after I've dropped it and solder a new actual lead onto that port. All right, it's not pretty, but because of the location where the pin soldered into the board, it literally covered itself up and I couldn't actually get solder up above the board where the port soldered on to actually bridge it. So we had to do the next best thing and find a jumper wire, solder to the actual post underneath, and solder it to the actual backside of the port. This should be stable enough. And that's about it. We'll see if it powers on. All right, we've plugged it in. There isn't any smoke, but we have a light showing it's charging, which is more than I had when I got it. Or at least, given it to fix anyways. Let's see what happens goofing around with the switches now. Line in. Okay, that's, it's fixed, I would say. Sweet, 